Hey guys, I'm Sharon Shetty Kuriala, the technical lead for tracking and planning component of engineering workflow management. I'll be giving a quick demo of the query organization using tags feature in Savano. This feature is available only for web clients. The agenda covers the supported use cases, the changes done to the query editor, the new look and feel of My Queries and Shared Queries tab. This slide lists all the supported use cases for the feature. Organizing personal and shared queries, search for a specific query, show the same query in multiple locations, run the queries from the tree navigator itself, create or edit queries in the same UI where the queries are organized, drag and drop queries to update tags. As we move ahead in the demo, we will cover how these use cases are supported in the tool. When you create a query or when you edit an existing query, you can now add tags to your personal or shared queries to help organize and retrieve your queries. To create a new query on the main menu, click work items and then click create query. Click the details tab. To add tags to your query select personal tags. Personal tags are used to organize queries in my queries. Only the owner of the query can view and edit these tags. Shared tags Shared tags are used to organize queries in the shared queries. The shared input section is only enabled if the query is shared. The ability to add, edit or remove tags on a shared query is controlled by the permission page in the project area configuration page. Select application administration manage this project area. Select Permissions and select the role of the person whose permissions you want to change. In the right pane, select Work Items, Save Query, Modify a Query, Modify Shared Tags for a Query. Note that the user would require the modify process specification permissions to save the changes to the process specification. Tags can be hierarchical. You can create a parent tag and child and grandchild tags. For example, here I have a hierarchy of EWM and a child tab and then verifications and its child 70S1. Click work items, my queries to see your personal queries. In the my queries tab, the queries appear on the right pane and the shared query icon appears indicating if the query has been shared. You can view the queries by all queries which lists all queries irrespective of whether they have tags. Untagged which lists queries that are untagged. Note that the tag that you created appears in the left panel with the green tag icon for personal tags beside it. If you share your tag, it appears with the blue tag icon. The right pane of the queries page lists the queries. At the top of the right pane, you can select from a predefined filter to view shared and unshared queries, only shared queries, only unshared queries. In the search box next to this predefined filter, you can further narrow down the search for your queries. For example, 
you could type unresolved to find queries that match with this particular term. If you select some queries and then clear the filter, the selection will remain checked. Similarly, if you change the filter text, uh, say, to fixed, the previously selected queries remain selected and visible even though it does not match the new filter. From the context menu beside the query, you can add tags to the selected query. Remove tags. Open the query in a new tab. Edit the query. delete the query. Note that when you click a tag in a query on the right pane, the tag is also selected in the left pane. Further, when you have selected a tag in the left pane, then click create query. The new query will contain the tags selected in the left pane. You can organize my queries by dragging selected queries from the right pane to the left pane. The operation of organizing queries by dragging them under a specific tag is additive. It does not remove or replace existing tags. Multi-select operations are supported for add tags and remove tags actions. Using the context menu beside the tag icon, you can rename the tag or delete the tag and all of its child tags. When you click on a query in the left pane, it runs the query and shows the results on the right pane. Similarly, clicking on the query name in the right pane also runs the query. When you click on shared queries, your shared queries appear. The list that appears includes queries that have been shared with you or with teams that you belong to. You can share queries with the whole team or specific users. The queries are grouped by team area or by predefined groups such as lifecycle queries, predefined and individually shared. You can use the drop down to show groups, show groups exclude empty or hide groups. An icon beside the query indicates if the logged in user is the creator of the query or not. At the top of the right pane, you can select from a predefined filter to view queries that are any creator created by me, created by others. For more details on the feature, please look at work item 474454 on jazz.net. To provide feedback on the feature, please open a defect or enhancement 
at jazz.net under the project rational team concert against the tag queries category you can also submit a formal RFE at developer works I hope this was useful thanks for watching the video